Hey everyone, Brandon from the A team. Here's an overview of what to expect from the Aperture 2-Bay Battery Power Station, or 2-Bay BPS. The Aperture 2-Bay Battery Power Station is a battery inverter that takes two 14.4 volt V-mount or gold mount batteries and can output a regulated 48 volt DC current. This allows users to use common batteries to power 48 volt fixtures like the Nova P300C, AMRAN COV product line, or any other 48 volt light, as long as it's under the power station's max output of 480 watts. Like its name implies, the two bay battery power station requires two batteries to function, otherwise it will not be able to output the boosted voltage. The power station includes a three meter three pin XLR male to female power cable to link up to your 48 volt units. The battery power station also features our lightning clamp quick release plate on the back, so it can be clipped straight onto the Nova P300C or into a lightning clamp on a stand. In order to cool the voltage inversion process, the battery power station does have a small fan, but it is fairly inaudible with the max noise level of 33 dBA at 1 meter. The power draw of the Nova P300C is 360 watts, so we recommend batteries with a continuous 15 amp discharge or 180 watts each in order to support the power draw. And even though we designed this product for the Nova, we also designed the Amaran COB lights to have 48 volt inputs, making them compatible with it as well. Simply connect a 48 volt 3 pin XLR output to the Amaran lights and you can proceed to operate them via battery power. However, the Amaran 100 and 200 series COB lights do not have nearly as high of a power draw as the Nova P300C. So in turn, you also don't need nearly as high end batteries. The Amaran 200 series has a max power draw of 250 watts. So we recommend batteries with the capability to maintain an 11 amp continuous discharge or approximately 140 watts each to support the power of the light. The Amaran 100 series uses even less power with a max power draw of 130 watts. So two batteries each with the capability to maintain a six amp continuous discharge or approximately 75 watts will be enough to power the fixture using batteries. As mentioned before, this power station can also be used with even higher power draw lights like an Aries Sky Panel S60C, which has a max power draw of 420 watts nominal and 450 watts true maximum. So as long as the batteries can discharge enough power to support it, this is well within the 480 watt output limits of the two bay battery power station. The battery power station is very efficient in its voltage conversion, so you'll be able to get the most out of your batteries. The power station will ultimately stop providing output when the power draw exceeds the capabilities of the batteries at a given voltage. And that's pretty much everything you need to know about the Aperture 2-Bay Battery Power Station, the accessory that lets your lights roam free.